reports that the Holston Armory ammunition plant is in the path of the fire. Request fire strike team for additional fire response capability. Uh, today we are participating in the 10CAT 2013 exercise. Uh, what that is, 10CAT is a catastrophic exercise that takes place across the state. Uh, each year it focuses on a different region. This year it happens to be East Region. Uh, the focus this year for us is wildfires. Uh, what we're doing, instead of fighting the fires, we are focusing on what happens, uh, everything else that happens. Communications, evacuations, uh, health concerns, essentially everything other than fighting the fire. As the day progresses, we'll be getting more calls on injects, which will be telling, which will be directing the play here. Uh, and each inject not only affects what hap what's decided in the room, but also how things are running in Nashville at the state EOC. Mm -hmm. And there's disasters going all, all over the whole region though, right? All over the whole region. Okay, so this is not just a regional or a local, but a statewide drill. It's a, it's a theoretically a statewide drill, but the focus is East Tennessee. So all the actual play is East Tennessee and Nashville at the state EOC. We're going to start the plot of evacuating. We're going to bring everybody which way? West. West. We're going to issue the evacuation. The mayor has issued the, uh, the actual evacuation order through the state. Uh, today we're uh, participating in the NCAT 2013 drill the state of Tennessee is having. Our goal right now is our, we've had a fire, a lightning strike, fires uh, impending on BAE and upper end of Hawkins County, and uh, our job now is to protect the citizens around that area. And we're looking at doing a one mile radius evacuation of everyone in the upper end of Hawkins County near that. Uh, we have uh, public health, we have Red Cross uh, all, uh, entities here to assist us in where we put them, uh, people with uh, special needs. Uh, we also are working with uh, their animals and everything, trying to see how, how quickly this can be organized and what we would need to do. Uh, the way this thing is going, we do not want to go east into Kingsport City and into Southern County because if something happens at BAE, you have more just across the river that could right. infect, affect them. Yeah, I think we go to Volunteer Hospital and set up there. So we're going to contact Volunteer High School. Mm -hmm. Have their contact numbers. We're receiving updates from the state of Tennessee. They're giving us injects of actually what is they're saying is going on, and then we're having to do the request back to the state of what we would okay. actually need for that. So you're having to make real time decisions based on the information presented by the state. Yes, sir. Okay, and and you don't know what's coming then. No, sir. I have no idea what the they. You never know what's coming. The, what was the last thing you were told? The last thing we was told was the that we uh, needed to request fire strike teams that the fire was uh, advancing straight toward BEA and that Forestry was not able to contain it. And then there was like a wind speed announcement. Wind speed, it picked up to 30 or 35 mile an hour gust uh, blowing uh, northeast, which that blows the fire right straight into the dead center of BEA. And it's noon right now. At, at this point, what what plans are your, is your team making? Our team right now is looking at uh, the large scale evacuation, uh, where we're going to put this amount of people, how we're going to notify them, uh, what we need to do this with. Yeah, anybody who's requested a fire strike team for additional help due to Holston Army ammunition plant and path of fire. County resources are on site and overwhelmed. Hawkins County Mayor is on site and declared Hawkins County State of Emergency. No, you need to erase that when he ain't on site. He's, <laughs> 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 he's not that crazy. He's state mayor's at EOC. We're looking at using county school resources uh, for buses. Uh, we use churches. Uh, any group that has vans or whatever can transport, uh, we're going to be utilizing all law enforcement agencies that we can here in the county. Uh, this is supposed to stress the county to the point of needing help, but all the other counties in the state of Tennessee is also participating in this, so getting help from other counties is pretty much null and void. You're on your own. We're on our own. Okay. Right? <laughs>